And that means it's time for the safe word. Yay, 1968 Corvette convertible. 1969 wall convertible. 1970, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 78 20th anniversary, 79. <laughs> There's a lot of C3s going all the way through the 80s. The C3 lived for, it had quite the lifespan. C2 did not last very long. 400 horsepower on the 68 versus 200 in an 82. Oh my god, the 80s ones are, are just awful. Okay, we gotta start out with the 69, obviously. And we're gonna put the Fathom Green. And put that straight to, ooh. Oh, I like that orange. Dude, I was gonna go straight to Tuxedo Black, man, but that orange, that orange caught me off guard. Arcade mode is basically just career mode again, but you don't have to go through the game straight through, like I am right now. You can actually choose to do the C5s first, should you so choose. Oh hey, we're finally back here at the, <laughs> at the stadium. I've eaten a lot today. I really shouldn't have done that, but I did. Yep, and we're really fast. As it turns out, we're super fast. Holy shit, we are very fast, as a matter of fact. Wow, the camera is shaking. You can you can tell that we're going fast because the chase camera is shaking. My goodness, wow. Well, that was quite something. And there's only one guy that can even compare. Everyone else must be in an 82 Corvette. 82, throwing it back to... Throwing it back to the first ever Corvette with being slow as all get out. That must be why no one remembers them. No one remembers the 80s Corvettes. I mean, at least some people remember the 80s Mustangs. No one remembers the 80s Corvette. Under a total overhaul in design, too, for the C4. C4 was around for a while. Oh! Big left turn. And now what are we on? We're on C8 now in real life, aren't we? Now even 20 years after this game came out. C5's lasted for what, 10 years? Oh! Ooh, I forgot about that little thingamajig in the corner that makes you slide for no reason. Forgot about that. Good thing I caught it just in time. Like when did C6's come out? Cause like there was, there were C7s in like 2014, weren't there? Man, the C6 must have been around for like five years. <laughs> Man. Shorter lifespan than the C2. Oh, this track is not well made. Corners are very cornery. <laughs> very pointy in nature. But we still won the race regardless. So that's a whoop de doo right there. Emmett Lane tried his best. But try as he may, he still cannot beat me, as I am just too good. As I am just way too good. I think after the next two races here, we will be officially halfway done with Arcade Mode. And would you look at that, it's 2,500 speed. <laughs> I think we can do this one with the slow Corvettes. Let's jump straight to 82. Straight to 82, I can't do a convertible. Unreal. 1982 Corvette Coupe. Ooh, that's a very rambunctious red. That's a good name for a cover. That should be a crayon, honestly. You know, dude, so <laughs> there was a thing in like 2000 where Crayola wanted like people to name new colors and like you could send in your names for the colors through snail mail, you couldn't even email it, dude. You couldn't even fax it, I don't think, but like, yeah. You were allowed to email that, and it's like, dude. Ridiculous. Oh, ch chase cam, close chase. Oh, 
Elevated chase, I guess. Oh, the nose cam. Also nose cam. Is there two nose cams? Yes, there's two nose cams. Incredible. What a, what a game. What a good game. You know, for being like 150 horsepower, this thing is still kind of, kind of, kind of swift. If I can get back onto the track, I'll have this race won. Yep, here they come. Here come the cavalry, because the goddamn bottom of the track decided it needed to be a mud pit. Yeah. I only know this because, like, I got a box of 96 crayons back when I was, like, three years old. And as far as I'm aware, I'm still, I still have those somewhere. And like some of those crayons, like they were a color and they, but the color, but it wasn't named. It didn't have a name. The color didn't have a name. And they wanted people to write in, I guess. Write in some names. I don't know what one. It's probably some dumb shit. Probably some real gay sounding shit. Dude. Probably, probably how it is. That tends to be how this thing goes. That tends to be how this always goes. Wonder if I, I should, that's what I should do is find a bunch of like old sweet steaks entry forms or like those like Sony newsletter things that you'd find in like the, the booklets of PS1 games. You know them? Try and find one of them and send it in and see if they, see if anything even happens. Not even expecting a response, just wanting to see if anything even transpires from that. Let's save the 25th anniversary for last. We'll do the 76. 76 Corvette Coupe. 210 horsepower. That's more than the other one, but... Oh, 165, but it's a convertible. Oh, but it's a convertible. That is rather persuasive, I won't lie. Ooh, bright yellow. There we go. Anyway... This loading screen takes so long. It's such a long loading screen. I don't understand why the loading screen has to be so long. There's no reason for it. Except a poorly designed game with way too much fluff. Like, these set pieces are ridiculous, honestly. Like, every square inch of these, of these tracks are pretty much finely crafted. Like, you got all these shipping containers is, you know, they're probably all individual objects lined out perfectly. I'm sure not a lot of things beyond the walls actually have, you know, grounds. Like if you found a way to glitch through the wall, you just fall through the world, right? Like you got a tank moving in the background over there. You got the giant sign with, you know, the player's view on it. There's a plane over there in the background. There's another plane. You know, there's a lot going on in this game. If only it was actually good. If only it was actually interesting to play. I say that, and like, what is, what's so different about this compared to like Need for Speed Most Wanted where I won every single race in that game, you know? Probably just the amount of customizability in that. You can't, you can't unlock body parts in this game. You can't, you can unlock, you know, upgrades, but it's like presets stuff. You know, even in like Juice 2, you can pick what brand of, you know, carburetor you want. It's like, Corvette, you just got, oh, you can choose the color or whether or not it's convertible. There you go. Have fun. Go banana. Oh my goodness gracious. I don't think I'm winning this race. And I'm only just now realizing how much this track looks like a boot. Looks like an old army boot. You know, it's probably what it is. Probably what it's based off. A big old army boot. There's three helicopters there. See, there's a lot going on in the background on this game. Way too much, in fact. There's another jet. Jet fighters never cry. Jet fighters never die. Yeah, I think I can still win this. 
I think if everything goes perfectly, I can still win this race. Yeah, it's a big if, I will admit. Everything going perfectly is a big ask, especially for a game with a physics engine like this. But I'm right on them. We're coming to the light. I just need to have a slightly better lap this time than I did the first time. See, not even a second back. We got this. We got this. We got this. Look at that. I'm already in the lead. Already in the lead. Just hit the wall a couple of times that first lap. Just had a couple of issues on the second lap, you know. We're fine. We're fine. Never mind the fact that this is the track that gave me the most trouble in this game so far. You know, never mind that. Never mind that. This location's fine. It's all fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. What is that sound? What is that sound? What was that? Was that part of the music? What was that? Sound like like an aliens. And invaded. We're gonna get probed in Corvette. Dude, what was that? I am so confused. That's some of the weirdest one of the weirdest sounds I've ever heard in this game. I wanna say it was part of the soundtrack, so we didn't hear that the entire rest of this race. Man, I'm so confused right now, dude. Well, we won that race. It was looking Looking not so likely there for a while, but we persevered. And we came home with the win. Back to the same menu music again. On the main menu. Yeah, Josie Rodriguez is really trying. Everyone's really trying. We now are officially halfway through arcade mode. It's only been an hour and 12 minutes. I think it's a pretty steady progress, dude. How about a 1972 Corvette convert? Or 71. 425 horsepower, there we go. Slap a coupe on that and let's go. Oh, there's no black, really? This this one didn't come in black, apparently. All right, we'll do the two-tone gold. So, I'm real fast, and the fact that you're a racer is a fiddle-dee-doo. My mom says, I l says, let's all die here. <laughs> I don't understand why. I'm gonna take that package. Are we gonna take the package? <laughs> it's good for your health. Your legs will get stronger. We're cars. We don't have legs. Mm. Ooh, woo!